All right, so in this video, I have this crazy box right here. This is a company called Dizygotic, and uh, the concept of what this company does is pretty awesome. They make two different pairs of sneakers, so they're kind of mismatched, and that's kind of like the idea of what Dizygotic is. Any which way, I love the concept of what they're doing, and I have both of the other pairs that they actually launched with as well. And they did send this over to me, but they didn't pay me for a review or anything like that. Uh, it was my pleasure to actually just grab these and do a review on these. This is actually an official collaboration with Cheech and Chong as well. If you don't know Cheech and Chong, uh, you should go check out some of their old videos uh, from the 80s and 90s and stuff on YouTube. They were just like smokers, like basically they smoked a lot of weed back in the day. And it was just kind of like, there. it was like comedy stuff. But what they did uh, with this pair is, is really, really something else. Now, in here you have four different sets of laces that it also is included with. You do have mismatched rope laces uh, in here already with yellow and blue. And I'll get into some of the theme uh, concepts here in just a second. But I also did want to show you that they do have a little butterfly, which is what they have in all of their products. So it's a little butterfly pin with some gems in it. It's kind of just a nice little look and something that they add to every box, which is... Pretty cool, it's like just a nice little extra detail. The box itself is awesome, as you can see. It has the uh, foam cutouts for each of the shoes, and then when you flip it over to the other side, it actually forms a mismatch butterfly wings. And, and I think that, again, Dizygotic, just the whole concept of what it is, is just super clever. And like everything that they do is so incredibly detailed and they focus on quality and whatnot, like just tremendously when, uh, when they're creating their products. The whole theme of the shoes basically come from their outfits from I think Up in Smoke. But the part that I really like the most is this little heel section right here has the mismatch uh, red paisley and then almost like the corduroy red on the other one. I just think it's so clever. Like you have their face and their head back here and then the bandana and the hat basically just on the uh, the back as well. Then the liner is kind of crazy. It's from the interior of their vehicle. Uh, as you can see, there's like the, the blue and the purple uh, fuzzy uh, joints right here. Really nice feel again to that. You do have the Dizygotic logo on one that is de-embossed. Then you do have a Cheech and Chong logo on the other tongue that is embroidered. And as you can see, there's mismatched colors and panels on both of the shoes. This one's primarily yellow and then this one's primarily blue again for their outfits in the video with little hits of red on this one. So we actually do get some denim up here for one of the laces and then a nice variation of a bunch of different blues on here. I like that they mismatched some of it too. You could see a little bit of the yellow on this shoe here and then a little bit of the blue on the other one it's just kind of the balance and symmetry it ties the whole project together but they also did some of that with some of the trim as well around the collar the midsole being the same color and the tongue being the same color and the under layer of the mid panel being like that white color as well something else another little hidden detail on these shoes if you look at the side panels both of them combined equal the dizygotic butterfly so it's one side it has the wing on here the other side has the other wing on this side it's just another hidden detail when you look at it you can just really appreciate the concept and like what they were going for and you think about what they've done with this company like pretty much sky's the limit like leave a comment in the comment section of what other like pop culture reference thing you think that they could create that would have the balance and symmetry of like two different entities into two different shoes but then kind of come together just on on one uh, pair i think that it would be really rad to see like an optimus prime and like megatron theme that would be kind of cool you could like do stuff like that but there's so many cool pairings of things that they could come up with and this is one that they came up with uh, and the whole backstory on it's kind of crazy like the idea of came to them on like 420 and then the delivery of like the international date is kind of cool But they also worked with Cheech and Chong to create this product Which I think is again super awesome another cool detail that I wanted to show you guys if you pull out the paper that's stuffed inside of the shoe It says this is not a quarter pound joint I mean it's just like such a clever thing to put inside of the shoe uh, to hold its shape uh, they made like little joints inside here. Also, they do have insoles that are pretty awesome. Uh, this one says Love Machine Muff Diver, which is their car and like the license plate that it had. And this one is signed by Cheech and this one is signed by Chong. So kind of cool that they have uh, like custom liners in the inside of the shoe. But then it gets one level deeper than that as they usually do. And it says Dizygotic on the inside of the strobe board on here. And then it has the butterflies with the mismatched wings on the strobe board on the other one. So uh, again, just smart details all the way down to the core of the shoe. Uh, really, really love what they do, man. And I'm happy that they reached out to me and were able to like send me some products, but really just show me that there's creative people out there doing creative things that might not have the big name brands behind it, but they're doing really quality work and it's it's really something cool, man. So they do fit a little bit snug for me personally. I got a size 10 instead of a 9.5 and I actually really do like the 10 instead of the 9.5, but I have a wider foot and I do like the feel of just the extra room. So that's just my personal preference. They send this little note. It says, thanks for being a part of the second Project Alpha product release. The Dizygotic Project Alpha celebrates the 420 International Cannabis Day and 710 National Dab Day 
with the boundary breaking cannabis counterculture legacy of Cheech and Chong. There was a Cheech and Chong inspired sneaker released uh, done in the past, and I think they're talking about the Nike Dunk uh, Cheech and Chongs that came out, but there was never a true official collaboration done with them. In fact, they couldn't call it that, obviously. Anyway, Nike really never did any official collaborations with Nike SBs, but this one, they actually did work with them. A journey from 420 to 710 is a concept that was developed on April 20th, 2022, 420, which is the actual date of 420. The team finished developing the prototype and showcased the shoe to Chi Chin Chong in person on July 10th, 2022, which is 710 in Los Angeles, California. And the release of the shoe happened November 17th at 422. I think that that, again, is just another cool, like layers and layers of thoughtfulness that goes into each of their products that they create. The quality of the materials are really nice as well. Uh, it's kind of an elevated price. I think they're like 267. But if you get a pair of them in hand, you realize like the quality of craftsmanship that went into the product of a company that is embracing the mismatched pairing of sneakers, which I personally really like, obviously, since like the what the dunks back in the day. And now they've created pretty much a brand off of it and released three different pairs of sneakers uh, with that same sort of concept. Anyways, this is the product right here. Leave a comment in the comment section. What do you guys think? And appreciate you all for stopping in and taking a look. Uh, I think they did a tremendous job on these and uh, I really, really like the end result results uh, from what they created and leave a comment like what mismatch theme do you think uh, they could tackle or one that would be cool it'd be fun to be able to see what you guys can think of out there honestly this is kind of like taking like nike id or nike by you and like just making your own sort of thing but they're like a professional company doing it uh with no limits and no restrictions of like certain colored panels that you could put here and there like i always love making my nike id shoes and stuff like that but what they're doing here is just the next level of of creativity by just creating their own a model, but also creating their own crazy uh, complicated colorways and levels of detail is is um, unmatched really by anything that I've seen on the market. So excellent work to the Dizygotic team. You guys are awesome. And if you guys are interested in these, check them out in the description of the video. Again, not a paid video, just something they sent out the shoes. Just something that I was uh, excited to share with you guys and hope you guys enjoyed. Have a good rest of the day. Hopefully we'll see you guys back on the channel for some more videos. And if you guys would like, please hit that subscribe button, notification bell to be notified when my videos are posted. Uh, hopefully we'll see you back. All right, peace guys.